Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Shaughnessy, and on this channel we discuss fragrance, beauty, and wellness. And if you simply like to have a good time and you like my vibe, subscribe. So y'all, I was requested to do another layering combination video, but I was like, what note? And then I started wearing a perfume and I was like, you know what, Shawnee, so you haven't done raspberry yet. So that's what we're going to do in today's video. I'm going to share with you some layering combinations with the raspberry note, okay? So we're, I was like, should I wait? We're going into spring, but the one I'm wearing now and a few of these, you know, they're year round and they work during this time of the year. So I was like, I'm just gonna go for it. So in previous layering videos, I showed you, you know, the shower gels, the lotions. Y'all, we're not doing all that today. I mean, as you can see, I have nothing on my message board back there because I was too tired to pick out the letters to put on the board. And I just could not, well, one, I don't have any raspberry shower gel except the ones that match some of my fragrance mist. Well, I will mention, you know, as I start talking about these, but I was like, I'm, I'm not going to bring those out if I have, you know, I'm not showing you anything different because I, I'll have the fragrance mist. But I don't have any raspberry shower gel. I don't have any raspberry bar soap. I don't have anything like that per se. So, and I'm, and I'm not bringing the lotions because I can just tell you. Yeah, I mean, I think y'all know. And if it's your first time, you know, watching a video like this of mine, I will say, you know, the steps in some of them to give you an idea because it really doesn't change. But we're just going to be showing the perfume, the fragrance mist, and all that. We're not doing the whole routine today. So the first perfume I want to talk about is Dolce & Gabbana's Light Blue Love is Love. Now this has a raspberry note in this perfume. And I, I can pick up the, the raspberry fruitiness in this scent. It is... Is think of a fruitier version of light blue, less citrus. That's what you get with this. So I decided to pair with Love is Love Radiant Berry. And Radiant Berry has notes of white raspberry and creamy woods. And when you pair these two together, you just, like I mentioned earlier, you get the original light blue with the sweet fruitiness of the raspberry because it's not really tart to me. And then with this fragrance mist, I wanted to emphasize, I wanted the creaminess you can get with this fragrance mist because in this perfume, there is an ice cream note. I don't get it. So I was like, let me add some creaminess to it with the creamy woods, the white raspberry. And it does. You get a fruity, creamy, sweet version of the original light blue with raspberry added. And it's a very fun, easy going combination that I think will work perfectly in spring and summer. So the next fragrance I'm going to talk about, I've mentioned quite a bit on my channel. It's very popular. This is Dolce & Gabbana's Pour Femme. Y'all know this, this is your marshmallow raspberry musk fragrance that's that's the easiest simplest way to describe this scent sophisticated sweetness in a bottle so i decided to pair with porfim raspberry sugar because the musk in this and the neroli Sometimes you just, it's like I said, it's sophisticated sweet, but if you want to add some sugary sweetness, I was like, okay, raspberry sugar, I think that'll be pretty good. So when you pair these two together, you do get a sugary, sweet, raspberry marshmallow fragrance, which I adore. This was, you know, I like this fragrance. I have to be careful how I spray this fragrance because of that neroli, but this, you know, amps up the sweetness even more so. So this is a good combination in my opinion. 
And I do have the matching lotion to this raspberry sugar. So I would pair the lotion and the mist together. And I would probably like use for the shower gel raspberry jam donut. Because like I said, I don't have any raspberry shower gels that are not from Bath and Body Works. So the next fragrance we're going to talk about is Mon Petty Intense Mint. And this is your fruitier, sweeter less patchouli version of Mon Perry. Little seductive, not as sparkling as the original Mon Perry. So I decided to pair with this raspberry chiffon. And raspberry chiffon has notes of black raspberry, ice pear, and whipped sugar. And I wanted to tell y'all, I didn't give you the fragrance notes of raspberry sugar because I don't have them. I just remembered that. So when you pair raspberry chiffon with the um, Mon Perry Intense Mint, you get a sweet, juicy raspberry, blackberry, like seductive, smooth fragrance. Because raspberry chiffon, to me it smells like a sophisticated, ra fruity, raspberry, blackberry kind of like a drink but sophisticated not fun summer fruity but it gives me like a sophisticated drink fruity drink you know and it just blends well with the seductiveness of this perfume it's a beautiful pairing it's it smells really good to me y'all so if you have these two i would recommend trying them out and with raspberry chiffon oh i do i have the shower gel to raspberry chiffon and i have the lotion so that's how i would layer these fragrances together with the other products and just on a side note for the soap that i would want to use i would probably use my olay strawberry bar soap with most of these just to give another berry or probably if it's a fresher layering combination then i would just use a really fresh you know, one of my Dove bar soaps or something like that. So that's the kind of bar soap I would use with these combinations. Okay, so next we're gonna talk about the original Mon Perry. And this is girly, fruity, bright, even with that patchouli kind of sparkling. That's what this gives me. This gives me a pretty girl, no, pretty woman scent, but it's got a girliness to it also, that this is very pretty in my opinion. So I decided to pair Mon Perry because you know of the season we're in, if you just didn't wanna have it be fresh and sparkly with Into the Night. And Into the Night has notes of raspberry noir, amber crystals, velvety rose petals, creamy patchouli, and mocha musk. So, like I said, with the original, not with the other Mon Perry Intense Mint, that it has seductiveness to it, this to me is girly flirty. When you pair Into the Night with this Mon Perry, it gives you, it adds that seductiveness to it. And I think this, you could wear it year round. I don't know if I want to pull out Into the Night during the summer where I live, um, unless it's nighttime, but it is a very nice combination that if you love Mon Perry, let's say it's your signature scent and you want to change it up a little bit and make it, you know, a little bit more seductive, Into the Night does that for this fragrance. Okay, y'all, so we have one more Mon Perry to talk about, and this is Mon Perry Couture. Now, this to me is it's fruity, they're all fruity, but this is like, this reminds me of like a drink, like a fruity drink, but again, womanly. Less patchouli, softer, smoother than the um, original Mon Perry. And I did a whole video talking about all of these, which I will link above. If you haven't seen it, check it out. So I decided to pair with Mon Perry Couture, Peace Ice Raspberry Bellini from Bath and Body Works. And this has notes of chill Prosecco, sparkling raspberry, and citrus twist. Yeah, and when you pair Mon Perry Couture with Peace, which is like a fruity drink also, 
you just, you get a fun, fruity, but womanly layering combination that's heavy on the raspberry. And that's to me just pretty casual you could wear it in the spring you could wear it in the summer well you could wear it anytime but i would probably i would lean more towards this for me probably springtime but it is a very pretty combination so next we're going to talk about mark jacobs daisy oh so fresh and this is what it says it's a fresh fruity floral i think it's pretty much even the fruits and the floral you get the raspberry that comes through there's a tartness to this fragrance also but i really like it it's like a powderiness to it also so i have two fragrance mists to go with daisy oh so fresh the first one i chose was confetti daydream and this has notes of fresh raspberry sparkling pear and blue iris and this is also it's a fresh powdery raspberry that makes me think of a, a, a slush or drink but it has that freshness it has that powderous powderiness that can come out with this so that's why i said oh this would probably pair well with it and it does it gives you a fresh but tart fruity floral that's heavy on the raspberry but you still get the powderiness you still get the floral like i said but it's just a fruity floral combination heavy on the raspberry and i really enjoy these two together now the other fragrance mist that i've worn i think last spring when i was wearing this this is body Ecology's raspberry and daisy and it has notes of ripened raspberries and daisy petals and i was like oh my goodness daisy raspberry when i saw this last year when they brought it out for spring and this is just, it's like the perfect pairing to this. You know, it just blends perfectly, enhances each other because they both have raspberry. They're both fruity, floral fragrances. So it's like a match made in heaven. So the next fragrance we're going to talk about is Bon Bon Summer by Victor and Rolf. And this is a very interesting fragrance. When I first purchased this, and I sprayed it. I said, oh, it smells like raspberry lemonade with a, like a sweet twist. But now I get more of a raspberry caramel. It's, I don't know. But it's light, fruity, but I do get that caramel note that comes out in this. So I was like, what do I want to pair with this? So I decided to pair champagne sprinkles with this. And this has notes of sparkling champagne, raspberry icing, and rainbow sprinkles yeah this combination together you get a sweet and creamy flirty raspberry scent i mean look at the packaging on both of these you know it's going to be girly and flirty and that's what you get and you know pairing this with the cream the cream is sweeter and it will help more bring out that sweetness in the caramel and the raspberry you just smell like a delicious treat but it's not too much for because we're moving into spring slowly but surely and it would it would be wonderful to me spring summer or year round because of that caramel note in this fragrance it's so pretty and this combination like i said girly flirty i mean look at the packaging so the next fragrance we're going to talk about is from terry mugler and it's angel nova now this is your raspberry like heavy i don't know what it is about mugler fragrances all of them have like depth to them they're never when i think of mark jacobs or like versace fragrances they're very light and airy most of them and mugler fragrances i'm like they got some weight to them so this is like a thick raspberry rose fragrance that, those are the two i think dominant prominent notes so i decided let's bring some playfulness because it's still playful but like i said it can it can be a, a bit much like i feel like with all my mugler fragrances so i decided to pair bloom box with 
Angel Nova. And this has notes of electric rose and pomegranate blast. You know, the, the lettering is coming off. So, Bloombox, it was love at first sniff. It's rosy, fruity, fun, flirty, pretty. So, I was like, this could probably pretty this. This is pretty, but bring, I guess, more fun. I don't really think of fun fragrances when I smell Mugler fragrances. So these two layered together gives a creamy, smooth raspberry rose. And this, you know, it, like I said, this Miss Bloom box brings some like fun, just a little pop of fun to Nova. So I do like this combination because I was like, woo, that's smelling good when I sprayed them together. So yeah, this is a good combination. And if you have bloom box because you know victoria's secret all their fragrances are limited edition so if you have this one and you have angel nova pull it out and see pair them together and see if you love it as much as i do so this next fragrance is from versace and this is versace woman and this is a fragrance that's hard for me to describe sometimes when i smell this i do think 90s but i love it i do get the raspberry in here i think raspberry shampoo fresh that's the best way i can describe this fragrance so i decided to pair with this uh versace woman raspberry tangerine and this has notes of wild raspberries fresh tangerine and lemon zest yeah and when you pair this is very fruity, tangy. When you pair Versace Woman with Raspberry Tangerine, you get a fresh shampooy raspberry lotion scent. Cause I, for some reason, when I add them together, when I pair them together, I was like, I'm getting shampoo and lotion together. I don't know. It's a combination that makes me feel shower fresh, but in the fruity way. You know, not the clean way, but you know how we you you. Think about if you have, you know, your curly hair, your products, and they're fruity, and you've washed your hair, you use a fruity uh, bath products, and you just, you smell fruity fresh. That's what this combination gives me. I know it will be wonderful in the summertime, and I'm looking forward to wearing it. Okay, this next combination features Hot Couture by Givenchy, the EDT version. Now, this perfume... Smelling it from the bottle, you get smoky, ashy raspberry. You have to put this on your skin. Because every time I smell it now, I think raspberry cigarettes because smelling it from the bottle. I know it sounds bad, but y'all got to put it on your skin. And I don't get like cigarette. But when I smell it from the bottle, that's Every time, that's what I think of. So I paired uh, Hot Couture with Triple Berry Martini. And this has notes of pomegranate juice, black raspberry liqueur, and strawberry sugar. Now, this is sweet, fruity drink. So I just said, let's sweeten this up, okay? Cut that smokiness some. And when you do that, you do get a sexy, smoky raspberry Think of um, a liqueur fragrance. That's what you get. And it's very nice to me. Um, like I said, I wanted to not take away all of the smokiness, but tone it down some. And pairing it with Triple Berry Martini does do that. And I, have, I haven't been saying it in every one, y'all, and I apologize. But I do have, like, the lotion, the shower gel, and this. So I would pair it all together and smell, like I said, a raspberry, sexy, smoky drink. Alcoholic. <laughs> Alcoholic drink. I want y'all to think I'm saying alcoholic. <laughs> so this next fragrance, you don't hear much about Cartier fragrances in general, but this is Baiser Volé Le Rose. This is a floral, <sighs> raspberry lemonade type of fragrance, but in a sophisticated way. It's something about Cartier fragrances that they have a sophistication to them. I mean, even the casual, because this I would describe as casual. It does. It has a sophistication. I wouldn't even say casual. Yeah, it, it, 
you can be casually sophisticated, very spring, summer. I love this. This was love at first sniff, uh, sniff and I hunted this bad boy down because I said, you will be mine. <laughs> so I decided to pair with Baser Lee Rose, again, Radiant Berry. And these two together, which I've said, I don't know how many times now, it gives you a casually sophisticated, creamy, citrus, raspberry scent that is very pretty. I think I did like wedding fragrances. I've only done it once, so maybe a year, maybe two years now. And this was one I thought would be nice for like your casual, you know, laid back wedding, not your super elegant wedding in the spring or summer. I thought this would be beautiful because like I said, Cartier fragrances, they have that sophistication and like that money smell to them. You know what I mean? So these two together, love this combination. It's very pretty. And like I said, to me, very spring, summer appropriate. Okay, y'all, we are almost done. So this next fragrance is Girl of Now Forever by Ellie Saab. This is my first Ellie Saab fragrance because I was trying to hunt them down too at a discount. This is one, y'all, it took me a minute with this. This is an intensely hard to pin down, but I do smell the raspberry, like sugary, heady scent, but I like it. It took me a minute, because first I was like, oh my goodness, what did I buy <laughs> from TJ Maxx that day? But it is good. I really do like it now. So I decided to pair with this Confetti Daydream because when I think of Girl of Now Forever, it does make me think sugary, sweet, fruity. And that tends to make me think of maybe like a drink, you know? And this gives me that also because I think of a, a raspberry slush sometimes when I smell this. So these two pair together just give you a fun, fruity, summer drink fragrance. That's what I get, like fun in the sun, summertime, summertime. So this is a good combination and I do enjoy them layered together. Okay, these last combinations I'm gonna show you all feature only one fragrance mist because it is in my project Use It Up, so I have been just pairing it with everything I think it would smell good with. So this is, Kenzo La Lixer. Y'all, this is just beautiful. It's good, okay? It's raspberry, caramel. Did I just break my top? Yes, I knocked this over. Oh, well. Raspberry, caramel, little powderiness, little freshness. It's just good. I always describe this fragrance as Prada candy, tone down the benzoin, and add raspberry. And you have Kenzo Elixir. Beautiful. So pair it with raspberry jam donut, which has notes of wild raspberry jam, powdered sugar, and warm fluffy donut. <sighs> you smell like a sensual raspberry dessert, okay? Think of, let me set the tone. You know how when you're on a date, or let's say, let's say you're celebrating your anniversary with your husband, and you reach over and you might be, you have some chocolate covered strawberries or something, some whipped cream, and you know, you get it up and you're like, here babe, here darling, take a bite. That's what this fragrance gives you, okay? When I say sensual raspberry dessert, that's the mood, that's the tone. I'm trying to tell y'all, this fire, this combination is good. G-O-O-T, okay, it is good. Smells divine, okay? So the next fragrance that I paired with Raspberry Jam Donut was Ari by Ariana Grande. And this is your, and I used it up, <laughs> paired it with this. This is your raspberry floral marshmallowy, and some people describe this as a donut fragrance. They get it also. So paired with raspberry jam donut, you just smell like a good snack. You know, you just smell like a snack. 
You just smell good. I remember when I was wearing this at work. Some I don't know. People were like, I smell syrup. I smell that it smells good. I don't I don't know if it was me. Cause I came out, I was like, y'all, does it smell like syrup? And they're like, no, but maybe it was the sweetness of it. Of the raspberry and uh the jam, you know, and this fragrance mist. I don't know, but this does smell sweet and delectable, okay? So the last combination I want to share with you all is a bonus because I wore it to work a couple of days ago and I just wanted to try this combination together because I haven't yet and shout out to Takara because she's the one who came up with this combination. So it is with Lanawi Trezor a la Folie and C. Fiore on top. So I paired all three of these together. And I received a few compliments that day and they were like, oh my goodness, you smell so sweet. And then another person, you just smell a little fresh too. It's just, I don't know y'all. And, and one was at the beginning of the day saying I smell sweet and pretty. And then the other comment compliment was at the very end of the work day where they said I smell fresh. So this combination lasted all day and was a compliment getter and i was uh doing doing my laundry and i said oh my goodness i smell smell the cardigan i was wearing i was like oh my goodness it smells so good so this combination is fire to car you were right immediately received compliments y'all and people have <laughs> stopped complimenting me that much at work because they're like they just you always just smell so good you always smell good so why we got to tell you, you always be feeling good but these this combination, oh y'all, I have been dropping my fragrances lately. So the this combination, like I said, compliment getter. Whoo, okay y'all, so that completes my raspberry layering combination video. If you enjoyed it, please give me a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below telling me what is your favorite combination with the note with the raspberry note because you know we're always excited to try new things especially since i'm not trying to go spend money on a lot of new things so it's fun to experiment so please share your raspberry layering combinations in the comment section down below to share the love please share this video with everyone who loves to smell good and to layer all their products to make it unique to yourself okay and please turn on your notification bell so you won't ever miss any of my videos and as i always say if you like my vibe subscribe until next time bye